In 2019, we believe that fair and equal access to public transportation is a civil right. However, this hasn't always been the case. While African American communities were fighting for equal access of the bus in the 1950s and 60s, the disabled community was fighting to get on the bus. Spurred by the civil rights fervor of the 1960s, the disability civil rights movement was formed, and one of its epicenters was Denver, Colorado, and the civil rights movement ADAPT. Originally standing for Americans Disabled for Accessible Public Public Transit, ADAPT was a grassroots community organization that made national headlines on July 5th and 6th of 1978. Known today as the Gang of 19, 19 ADAPT protesters used their wheelchairs to block in a city bus at the busiest interchange in Denver, while chanting, Because of the 1978 bus protest and other ADAPT demonstrations like the Capitol Crawl in 1990, accessibility became the law of the land with the passage of the Americans with Disabilities Act. However, because of the strong presence of ADAPT, Denver was the first city in America with a fully accessible public transit system in 1985 and is still one of the most accessible cities in the world today. Because of the accessibility of the city, Denver now boasts a large and active disabled community. One of the cornerstones of this community is the theater company Family Theater Company an all-disabled theater company that was started in 1989. For 30 years, Family Theater Company has performed musicals and plays that force an audience to rethink their definition of disability. While most artistic organizations have difficulties accommodating disability, Family Theater Company has been a platform for disabled artists in Denver to highlight their artistic voice. In 2015, I performed with Family Theater Company in their summer production of the musical Cabaret. The musical tells the story of the rise of the National Socialist Party in Germany and its effect on the gay community in the cabarets of Berlin. However, Family allows the actor's disability, my disability, to become an active component of the show's narrative and change its meaning. The actor's disabilities force the audience to recognize the historical role of disability in the Holocaust. Instead of merely being a theatrical prop, disability enables an actor to tell stories that are important to the disabled community. While working with family, I felt connected for the first time to the disabled community, a community that has deep roots in Denver, Colorado. And every day as I rode the bus past Colfax and Broadway on my way to work with Family Theater Company, I thought about the power of disability and the disabled community. The disabled community is not a weak and marginal group. Instead, it is a community that fights to be at the center of any national discourse. Through either civil disobedience or community theater, the disabled community continuously fights to reconfigure the cultural definition of disability and demands to fully integrate into society as an equal member. Truth and justice on our side. By the grace of God above, our battle cry is love, and we will rise.